Pilgrims, and welcome to episode 30 of the Polygon Pilgrimage. Today we're going over digital drawing. Now what you see before you is a super time lapse of me doing exactly what I'm going to describe. Uh, recently I found some amazing videos from master artist Feng Zhu, and he describes this process by which you can take randomized drawings from uh, Alchemy, is what I use, and you take the silhouette, and then as you apply value to it, you learn how to pull shapes from that value. So first what I did was I took a piece of randomized drawing that I liked. I selected it by using uh, a black and just created a silhouette, cut that out, and then did a gradient. Now using the gradient, I can create you know a sense of light to dark immediately. And then now what I'm doing is just going in with a brush set to a very low opacity with just black and just white and going through and adding value and it's all about creating shape through value so you want to make sure that you put in you know the light where the light is hitting and the dark where the light is not hitting and you know follow those basic principles and here you see the shape starts to come out it's really easy to do it's really fast and it's nice to kind of relax a bit and kinda of let the shape speak to you instead of always trying to push a certain shape into it and I'll do uh, maybe five or six, sometimes seven or eight of these in a night. Sit down and just create a bunch of stuff in Alchemy and then throw it into Photoshop and start playing and see where the shape takes me. And here you'll see what ended up working here. It looks sort of like a mechanical glove or some kind of armor piece. I made some twisted fingers at the bottom to give it kind of a, an uneasy sense. And then to kind of emphasize the fact that I saw some lines in it that looked like they might be armor panel lines, that's what you see me sketching in now, is I'll go through and add some of those dark values and then really push it with the light values next to it to kind of have a sense of here's where an edge is folding in on the armor. And so, you know, just add some ribbing there and the circular detail at the top and flush a couple of things out and you have your armor piece. And it's really, you know, it's nice to relax and kind of turn your brain off a bit and this is a good exercise to just paint in value. A lot of people are so worried about making a shape technically correct that they lose the sense of making the form correct first. You know, the first thing that we have to make sure is that the shape fills the volume that it should, and that's what we do here. So go ahead and try this technique out, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. Please enjoy the quote at the bottom of the page, and I'll see you next time as the pilgrimage continues. shapes from that value. So first what I did was I took a piece of randomized drawing that I liked. I selected it by using uh, a black and just created a silhouette, cut that out, and then did a gradient. Now using the gradient, 